Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can fix the Valorant games error. This build of Vanguard requires TPM version 2.0 and it also needs a secure boot. After you have up, uh, upgrade your Windows to Windows 11, so first we're going to restart the computer. Okay, so we start the computer and this is for MSI motherboard. Once the computer is starting, you press on the delete button. So press on it continuously so that you can go into your BIOS menu. Okay, once you are in your MSI, click BIOS 5 menu. We're going to click on settings. First, we're going to click on security then click on trusted computing and then click on security device support and you want to click on, on that and choose enabled and down here you should see it say TPM 2.0 devices in the device select okay after that we're going to go back into settings and then click on advanced now we go down and click on Windows OS configuration and in here in Windows 10 WHQL support you want to choose click on that and you want to choose UEFI okay so select that UEFI and then in secure boot it will show something like this but before we can change anything you need to reboot your computer so we're going to click on the close button and then click on yes and now press on the delete key continuously to boot up into BIOS again okay after you have put back into BIOS click on settings click on advanced then click on Windows OS configuration and then click on secure boot now you want to click on secure boot mode if you click on this and click on enable sometimes it may work uh, if not you will need to click on secure boot mode and then choose custom and then click back on standard and it's an install factory default press yes to proceed then click on yes and then after that you can go in and choose secure boot support to enabled okay so give that a try and after that click on the close button then click on yes and okay so after your computer uh, rebooted we can uh, start the game Valorant again and give that a try and see how you go okay so now you should be able to start up Riot Games and then here you can start play it. Uh, you can start to play Valorant again and that's it guys uh, I hope you can fix the error and enjoy your gameplay Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.